Ohayo kasaymas, tama ba sinabi ko? Trinay ko lang. Dahil magluluto tayo ngayon ng Japanese fried chicken o mas kilalang chicken karagi. So, sisimulan na natin ang ating chicken karage. So, meron ako dito ng chicken pieces or chicken fillet. So, ideal nito ay gumagamit ng chicken thigh fillet or pork fillet. Pero, ang gamit ko dito ay chicken breast fillet. Dahil ayoko maging masyadong greasy ang ating chicken breast. Kasi gusto ko yung maging meatiness ang ating chicken. At kailangan natin ng cook for fillet para i-limate At ito ay 500 grams ng chicken breast. And we will marinate this with Japanese soy sauce. Kung wala kang Japanese soy sauce, you can use regular soy sauce. So instead of sake, I will use vinegar. So ito siya, 3 tablespoons of vinegar. And 3 cloves of garlic. So, napakasimple lang. At yun lang ang ingredients natin. So, halo lang po natin ito kasi mamarinate po ang ating chicken breast. So, we let it rest for 5 minutes para ma-absorb natin ang ating marination. So, after we marinate this, we add 1 cup of cornstarch. And, halo lang po natin ito hagat makuk po ang ating chicken. So, kung may potato starch kayo sa bahay, pwede nyo gamitin yun. At mas, be mas better yung gamitin yun. Kasi yun naman talaga yung, yung ingredients ng ating chicken karagin. So, when you mix your corn starch, at medyo dry siya a little bit. So, you can add water, pero buy a tablespoon lang. So, pa isang-isang tablespoon lang hanggat makuha nyo yung consistency na hanggat mag-cook yung inyong chicken. And now, ipipilito na natin to. So, ilalagay na natin to sa mainit na oil. So, remember, pag nagpiprito kayo, bawat part para hindi kayo matalsikan ng mantika. So when you fry in batches, bago mo ilagay yung second batch, dapat uminit na ulit yung oil mo. You have to let your oil or heat to recover or else malamig siya. And it's gonna soak in the oil at nagiging greasy ang chicken mo. So hihintayin natin ito mag golden brown at maluto po ang ating chicken. So after a few minutes, and look at that, our chicken is already cooked and it's golden. And it is important also you eat it right it away. Huwag mo ipaiwan sa lamesa ng kasagal before eating it para maging crispy ang ating chicken karage habang kinakain natin. So, pwede na natin ito iset aside. And iseset aside na natin ito. So, our chicken is very golden and yummy. So, naging crispy siya dahil gumamit tayo ng cornstarch instead of flour. So, naging gold, nagsim, naging brown siya dahil of the soy sauce. So, tapos na iprito ang ating lahat ng Japanese fried chicken. Sobrang dali lang gawin. So, sana may try nyo itong recipe. At alam kong magubos ng buong pamilya nyo. Lalo ng mga bata. And, we're ready to play. So, sobrang sarap itong Japanese fried chicken. At ang sauce ng ating Japanese fried chicken is Japanese mayonnaise. So, kung wala kayong Japanese mayonnaise, pwede naman kayo gumamit ng regular mayonnaise. So, pwede nyo lang natin yung plate. Japanese harake, lutong Pinoy!